In this little video, I want to demonstrate the world's first 3D copy machine, which runs fully automatically and is based on open source hardware and software. On the right side, you can see the OpenScan Mini and in the center, you see the well-known Prusa Mark III. The OpenScan Mini is now taking pictures of the object from all sides making sure that the illumination is equal and that there are no visible shadows or reflections on the object. In this first pass, there are around 100 images, which takes roughly three to four minutes. After that first pass, the object has to be uh, reoriented so that the underside can be captured as well. Just confirm that the object has been reoriented and start the second pass. Again, the scanner is taking 100 images, which takes another three minutes. All the images are stored locally on the scanner, which is basically a Raspberry Pi controlling the two motors and the camera. And you can now either download those images from the device to your PC for local processing or as we did in this case here, upload those images to the free and open OpenScan Cloud, which is an accessible uh, photogrammetry API that anybody can use. After roughly 20 minutes of reconstruction, the model is automatically downloaded sliced locally through uh, Prusa Slicer console and transferred to Prusa Connect and printed on the printer. The printing process is what's taking l the longest time and after a total of four hours, you got the one-to-one -one copy of the Banshee. Some more notes on the whole process. The orientation of the Banshee is somewhat random as the scanner currently does not know at which uh, orientation it starts, the scanning process. This could be fixed through software though. And one more note, the whole automation is only possible because all the software and hardware is accessible through APIs. And it would be amazing if other manufacturers would join this initiative and this idea as well because this could make for some great use cases. This particular use case is just a proof of concept that it's easy with existing software and hardware to create a 3D copy machine. The automation was built in roughly an afternoon of programming and it's not for production yet but we just wanted to show what is possible. Even though the scanning wasn't super detailed, it was able to capture the layer lines and many print accuracies and they all show up in the resulting model. Note that due to the orientation of the print, there are very significant printing artifacts and from the removing of the support structures. Here you can see the raw 3D scan result where the inside of the cabin and even the inside of the container have been captured very well. These are generally very challenging areas for almost any scanner. And finally, you can see the printed result on the right side and the scanned model on the back. Note that there are many small speckles on the scanned model which are absolutely necessary for photogrammetry to work well. Hope you enjoyed it. If you want to find out more, check out our blog at openscan.blog.